Hey guys, good morning. Good morning. So you're wondering why she come on on here so excited in the morning with a glass of champs. What time is it by the way? I don't even know what time of day it is. I'm telling you. I think it's morning though. Ten minutes after eleven. So it's still in the AM, but it's ten minutes after eleven. And um, I am going to the spa today. And it, if that wasn't enough, I'm going to brunch today. So I'm excited. I'm off, guys. It's Saturday. And guess who's off? Me. You guys know I work Saturday and Sunday. I would be at work now thinking about getting off in 20 minutes. No, but I'm here today. I switch my friend. You know me and her do them things at some time. But if you're new to this channel, guys, you are most welcome. And if you come back, you don't know. All right, guys, so it's an excited morning. I love stuff like that. I'm that type of a girl. I'm a spa girl. You know, I'm not just a going out girl. I'm a dress up girl. I want to get dressed to go somewhere. And I'm a spa girl, a movie girl, a dinner girl. I'm just that girl that want to be out doing something and like nice things so i was like why not you know the reason why i'm having some champs and i also have some starbucks good morning um and i know i say i'm going to brunch but um i'm going to the spa first so i was like you know because first i had some crackers and tea early this morning because guys i've been up since five i haven't been asleep but anywho i was gonna go to brunch but my husband booked me two spa appointment not one but two um yeah so i'm gonna do one today and one you know when i get the chance again another day i don't know maybe next saturday so good morning open morning i go good and um yeah enjoying your breakfast whatever you're having um we're going to be so in brooklyn i love brooklyn um, I don't know, I'm excited. I guess because I have so much family member over there too. Do I have family member? I have friends that I love. That's like my family over here, but I don't have that. All our families are in Brooklyn. I mean, all over the world, but since we're talking about Brooklyn, family is in Brooklyn. Lots of cousins and auntie and uncle and, you know, these are my family that I married into, but they love me and I love them. So, love who love you you know what i mean that's my new thing love who love you because some people are no good no good and i'm learning that i was just talking to one of my best friends you know i have two best friends i'm so lucky and um she said um you know sh sh we're gonna meet up thursday so i'm gonna get to dress up again and i'm gonna get to go out again i love to get dressed up and i love to go out and i don't know i'm acting like a child but that's the child in me i don't know if that's childish but anyhow i'm excited about that so I'm going to go out with my friend Nikki on Thursday and I'm excited about what I was saying, talking about Brooklyn, right? Yeah, so we're going to Brooklyn. That's where I'm getting my massage and that's where I'm getting my, and that's where we're, we're going to eat. So, and I know it's kind of late. I should have, we should be leaving now so I could get my massage. I leave at 10.30 so I could get my massage and then go to brunch. What's Okay, brunch go up until 3. Brunch start usually between 11 and 3. It's brunch. Before 11 is breakfast. If you have any before 11, it's, I think it's before 11.30. It's considered, still considered breakfast. Um, yeah, so if you're having it between 11.30, I think, and 3.30, it's considered brunch. <laughs> so, yeah. So I'm on here to do a get ready with me. You know, I'm a love to get ready with me and I just love to dress up and I have this dress that I have now for five, four or five years. I'm not sure either if it's four or five. Never wear it. Never wear this dress. Just never, you know, attempt and then I put it back and I attempt again and I put it back and then it, then it's been sitting in the closet. So I took it out and last night and said, I'm wearing this dress. It's time to wear this dress and it's perfect because we still have hot weather. 84 degrees guys 84 degrees and it's 11 in the morning yeah so perfect before the weather get too cold and then i can't wear it 
let's get it out of the way look at it this is the dress it's a mini dress and it got a slit on the leg and it got lace see the lace and you see the lace here there we go lace right there in the front the back I have lace as well the tag is still on it because guys like I said it's been it's fashion over by the way and it's been sitting in my closet for years so we're gonna wear this lacy dress and guess what we're gonna wear it with sneakers because we're cute <laughs> and this is a blue I'm gonna be a blue Barbie girl okay I'm a Barbie girl but I'm wearing blue oh you know what I talked of last night a picnic not picnic, pink nick. Isn't that cute? Because I heard some funny stuff about picnic. I like picnic, but I heard some funny stuff about it. I'm not even getting to that. But I thought that was so cute that we could all dress in pink dress, find a nice spot before it gets too cold. I'll wear pink dress and have a pink nick with pink champagne and tell everybody to bring something pink. So I don't have to stress about doing all the work. You know what I mean? Because you, you guys know. Um, yeah. Any type of pink thing you can find. A pink bottle of drink. A pink whatever. And I will get the, you know, do the blanket. Or we find a nice table. I could do the, I'll set up the table. But show up with stuff. And I think people will do it. Show up with something pink. Or white. We don't want no other color on our table. We don't want no green. Even though we love green because, you know, the color of grass, trees, and money. And that's my, one of my, that's why it's my, one of my favorite colors. Because it's like, you know. Um, yeah. <laughs> but, <laughs> picnic. You know, since the Barbie thing is going on and everybody's having a pink boat ride. And a pink this and a pink that and a Barbie this, Barbie that. And I was like, you know. Not to bring it up because I'm trying not to bring this thing up. But since I'm going through the breast cancer thing and October is right. The breast cancer month is coming up next month. We're in September, right? October, yeah. So, I was like, perfect kind of end of summer thing. I could do also go to the spa, Soul Joe Spa. We all wear a pink bathing suit and have like a little, you know, get, you know, a little send off thing to me. Because we don't know how I'm going to feel. You know, I'm feeling... Sada fabulous Sada sort off the sort of is this the fabulous is not this because I am fabulous but the, the I'm kind of feeling sort of when I get excited and I'm recording I'm getting dressed and stuff I'm always up but sometimes I get tired but um yeah but that's beside the point I want to do either something at the spa something at the park where we wear a pink dress or something at the spa where we wear a pink bathing suit or boat either or boat you know but when we get to that, we get to that. Let's get dressed now because my husband is already dressed. Looking cute. He's wearing blue shirt and white Calvin Klein jeans. So we're coordinating. Yeah. I'm going to pick it out. I'm going to pick out him clothes. Sometimes you just have to take it. Take things in your hands and pick out him clothes. So I'm going to pick it out because I'm not waiting for him to dress. And then I'm going to black and blue. I'm not, well, not even blue because sometimes, you know, they dress and they don't think about what you're wearing. So they coordinate. You would be wearing like black. And you know, some other color, brown or something. No. So I picked this out last night and I picked him out the shirt and put it right next to it. <laughs> we need to leave these men alone, right? Let them wear what they want to wear. No. You marry. You match me. Anyways, at least he does um, 50% of the time. Because sometimes I can't bother. I just say, wear what makes you happy. Because I want him to be happy. But then sometimes you look what I'm wearing and sometimes you go and intentional do it. Or, oh, I didn't know you was wearing that sneakers. If I know, I would wear mine. Because we have like maybe one sneaker that match. You know, and maybe like two shirt that match. Yeah. So, but I don't like to be exact matchy-matchy like I have this on, he has to have this on. No, I like, he's wearing a blue. Even though it's not the exact shade of blue, he's wearing blue. So we don't look like we're coming from two different households. Anywho taking up all the time just chatting let's get ready when i come back i think i should do my should i do my makeup first mm -hmm. when i come back i'll have the dress on okay so i'm back on to show you the dress oh my god this is so good and guess what it was free 
Mm. Men nu er jeg jo i fremst til at være øjt fri. Men nu er mm. Pumpkin spice latte. So on Thursday. Every Thursday. In September only. They're doing buy one get one free fall drinks. That's a fall drink. Buy one get one free. I bought it and of course I took two of these. And you know you're not gonna drink two, so one was in my refrigerator. So good I didn't need it. It was feeling a little hot. Mmm. I think if I'm talking so fast, explaining stuff to you because I gotta go. Yeah, so wait. Oh my boy is not gonna be showing me that. But maybe I'm gonna have to ask my husband to help me with the back cars if okay. I'm gonna maybe have to get help with the back. But anywho, this is the trip. It's short. You like? And they're gonna go with this. Ugh. Gonna look cute. I'm gonna look so cute. <laughs> I'm gonna look so cute. Look at these. Oh my god, I'm gonna look so cute. Anyhow, they're in the box. If you're wondering why I put the dirty shoes on the bed, because I wore those before. Those I wore at least twice. I think once or twice. Yeah, so those are the sneakers, and this is the dress. So I'm giving chic sporty or sporty chic. Sporty chic. Yeah, that's what I'm giving. Sporty chic and look at the girls. Can't sit over with me. <laughs> I'm good. Yeah, so I took the strap off this bra, of course, but I don't know. Is it behaving? Or I don't want to not wear a bra because um, sometimes you don't wear a bra with these light colors. If you sweat because it's 80 something degrees, then the sweat is just going to run down at least if you have on a bra if a little sweat comes it will go on the bra and i think that will kind of save me i'm gonna have to ask my husband to go turn the car on when i'm ready to go outside before i go out there because i'm not sitting in no hot car so this is the dress guys again let me go do my um i know i know i have a panty line but my shorts thingy that i wear on the clothes um to not show panty lines I can't wear them because this is too short. This is like really short guys. See that? It's right up there. So if I put those on there too long and then plus I have the slip on the legs that I put that on, it's gonna um, show. So I can't wear them so you're gonna see panty line because I'm not going outside. I'm not one of those girls. I was at the, in Miami, let me get myself together because I'm chatting again and now I'm gonna want to So I was at my, in Miami the other day as you guys know and if you don't know go watch my video if it's your first time coming here you're welcome guys go watch my other videos please i appreciate it and don't just watch this video and go away please subscribe and like i said go watch my other videos but yeah i was in miami right and um this girl had a chocolate brown dress with the whole side cut out see through you know those dress nice dress the girl looked good body look good face look good everything on point chocolate girl pretty girl you know dark dark skin i said chocolate but the clothes is chocolate she's chocolate but you know what i mean yeah so anyhow she had this chocolate brown outfit on and um dress with the slit on the side and guys she was sweating right and she wore no undies she want you know she had the slip so she wanted to look she was like i'm not wearing no drawers i'm in miami i'm just pretending i don't know her i'm not wearing no drawers i'm in miami and i want to look good and i don't want to have no panty line so yeah guys she starts sweating like she sat down on her vagina let's just keep it real so we can move on and not say whatever i was going to say her vagina starts sweating i guess you know because the spot was right in there when she stand up i saw it when she asked to move her table because we were outdoors 
in Miami, you know, being outdoor in Miami is rough. But it was at uh, Mickey Beach. And um, yeah, because even me, I asked them to move my table because it was ridiculous where they put me. I don't know why. I was looking at other people and they were sitting down kiki with umbrella over there. And I was like, but my umbrella is not shading me. You need to. And he went and, you know, we asked, of course, and they went and they got me. A, they got us an umbrella. And everything was okay with that. But she got up and moved to another table. And when she got up and moved, there was an icky spot right where her buttocks, you know, like she see from her vagina in the back. And guys, not only that, it was wet. So that's one thing. There was icky white and yellow stuff. I'm not being mean. I'm just telling the truth. This is things that happen to a lot of people. I'm not saying all of us have wet baggy panty drawers sometimes because if it's hot, you sweat, reunion, man sweat, woman sweat, it happened. But people don't think about the colors and I used to have a fear. Maybe even that's why I didn't wear this dress yet. I used to have a fear of these things happening to me. And I find out that my fear made me sweat more, you know? So I try to dress and keep my environment cool so these things don't happen, but she should have known better. In Miami with a dark color like that, with a chocolate brown, you're gonna sweat and wet that up. I know that. I would even wear like this color, right? Not with the floor, with the print on it, it's fine. But say I'm wearing this green, I would not wear it in Miami in the day and go sit in nobody hot outdoor restaurant. I know my backside is gonna sweat and you're gonna see it, keeping it real. I felt bad and I wanted to tell her, I even talked to my husband and my life, but she's with her friends. She's with four other people, you know? And I'm like, and some people like to say you're hating on them when you go tell them, try to help them out, you know? Cause I always say I help women cause I want them to do the same for me. We have to stick together. I don't know why they didn't tell her. And she sat down and she ate. And I said, hopefully it will be dry when she get up. They get up and left. No. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'll be back. So this is it, guys. This is all the makeup you're going to get. You know, I'm not a makeup guru. I just do what works for me. Put a little something, something on. I don't do no contouring. I don't do none of that. Okay? I put my powder on. I'm keep it moving. So this is it. And I put a little eyeshadow on today. I have the... Where is it? The Stella. Got the Stella Blue. I think this one is called Rain Something. Rainfall. Rainfall. Okay, I have it on at the end out here, right out here, and then I just put a little blue shadow, regular old fashioned blue shadow. I don't, it's the name not even under container anymore. I have it so long, I think it's essential or something. It's barely on there. I see a S and I see a E and I see, you know, yeah. But anywho, this is what you get because that's all I have. I just don't do anything else, guys. And the blue is not clown, clowny, right. It's not, it's not overdone. I think I can do a little bit more. Give me, give me a second. Okay. I did put a little bit um, a, um shadow <laughs> or whatever on my bro bone right there. But this is all you get. This is me. I'm wearing these big um, vintage studs they're huge they're clip-ons i've them for a while now maybe a year or more two years and i never wore them so this is me what do you think do i look like a pink a blue barbie <laughs> i'm not wearing pink what the hell am i talking about yeah do i look like a little blue barbie and then i'm gonna look even cuter when i put my Sneakers on. My cute sneakers. <laughs> Jesus, Abba, what's wrong with you? I'm not drunk, guys. I still have the same glass. I didn't even drink a whole half. 
I'm just in a good mood. So we're gonna, I'm wearing my wedding ring and we're gonna wear, of course, if we're wearing this, then it calls this watch, right? And I'm wearing my bigger watch because I'm wearing sneakers. So this will give it the sporty chic look. You know what I mean? Because it's looking chic in there with all those stone, all those rhinestone. It's a Michael course. Um, yeah, so the bigger watch. If I was wearing eels, maybe I'd have gone for the tinier watch. We should this. It's okay. And then this is the real deal. Recognize. Okay, recognize. Real deal. That's my birthstone. What is it? I forgot my own birthstone. Is it aquamarine? Aquamarine with diamonds around it. Darling. Ex husband can't take my queen, don't believe you. <laughs> so, yeah, this is my um, birthstone, guys. Anybody want to get me something, get me this color. That's my birthstone. And you see the diamonds around it? Yeah, yeah. Girls with the big girls with the big rings. That's all we need on our fingers, because that's a lot. That's doing a lot over here, and it's doing a lot over here. Yeah, so this is the accessory. And then my sister bracelet that my sister gave me. That's my sissy gave me, my sissy poo. Also my sisters. It's Ventany, this one. This this is the one that live in the city, in, the, in Manhattan. She gave me this. So this is the accessories. I'm not gonna overdo it. Or should I? Should I add anything? I think I look good. I don't need anything else. I'm gonna leave it at that. What do you think about this? It doesn't match. I'm thinking I should go for safer kind of metallic -y kind of purse that goes with this. But I'm wondering, do I have? I'm sure if I look hard enough, I find something that matches this. I don't know. Hold on, guys. Let me go see. Okay. So this is what I come up with in two minutes. I have this, which I think might be, you know, I might just take it, make life easy. Because that blue, mm-mm. Mm -mm, not feeling it. Let me see myself in the mirror. Nah. Nah. I mean, I could do if it's still blue. I don't know. I'll make up my mind at the end, but I'm thinking maybe this one is going to be the one. You know, I'm looking in the mirror over there if you're wondering. Yeah. And then, I could be over the top. <laughs> Who can stop me? Why not? You know, I'm over the top here. I could just be over the top. Is it too much? For day, I just, I love being over the top. You know what I mean? And I don't care if it's day. Maybe I should just do it. Who make up the rule? Why does this have to be for evil? I'm taking the day. I'm taking, I'm taking the day. You know what? I want this bag by. I never remember this name. It's all letters. W P E I whatever. I think it's W P E I or whatever. You know what I'm talking about? I have one of those bags. Never wore it yet. Still didn't wear it. I have so much stuff I didn't wear yet. Um, they have it in this, guys. I'm gonna buy it. They have it. That Jesus. That will shut down the room when you walk in. You know, a lot of people have this, but that one I haven't seen nobody. Else. I see it in different color on one girl. Portia Nicole, you're on YouTube. She has it in gray, but I have it in like the nudie color. I haven't worn mine yet, but I saw her in a recent video like two days ago wearing hers. I wonder if these are heavy. I'm kind of worried about them because they're, they're big. And I want to wear them. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to bring these little G for a backup. But I really want to wear my big ones. So I'm going to bring those. Hope I don't forget. I'm going to bring those with me. So if it come down to where these are making my ears feel heavy or tired or whatever, I'll switch them out. But yeah. I don't know. I'll, I'm going to go downstairs and let my husband take picture of me. So you'll see it in the thumbnail. Alright. So bye. 
see you at the spa and restaurant bye guys see you in a bit Time to get undressed for the massage and facial. I didn't know my husband booked a facial, so I have a 30 minute facial and a 60 minute massage. Surprise! And I did my makeup. Hope this is the music that they're playing in here. It won't give me copyright. I can barely hear it, but you never know. Guys, yeah. I know I told you guys I was going to um brunch yeah, later in the day because um I end up um getting a facial, so I'm not wearing any makeup again anymore. Um, my husband, I didn't know you got me a facial too. I thought you only got me a massage. That's why I did my makeup this morning when you guys see me in my makeup. We came to Biso, we finally finished my massage and my facial. So we came to Biso to have um, dinner, so it's kind of late in the evening. And um, they just said that they are um, closed to reopen for dinner. On their website today so open from 11 a.m. to 1 a.m. And now they're saying that they're closed to get the kitchen ready for dinner. So there was a place right next door that's vegan that attached to it. So I'm in here enjoying this food to show it to you. I have mac and cheese that's okay. Meat don't taste bad, but it's not that fabulous. The way she was saying that they just go first. There was um, a young man standing in here when I walk in. And he said the curry was good, so I took some of that as well. So this is curry potatoes. Oop, that's hot. He said it was good. So, I'm going to try. It was right. And the macaroni and cheese is not bad. Just that, I, you know, it's not all of that the way she was talking. Just, it's okay. It's okay that macaroni and This is what? Is this? this is like calories. No. Collie green. It's good. She just said it's finished. She's really just telling them in the kitchen just to get it ready. Get more ready. Alright. Oh, I didn't tell you what else was in here. Rice and peas. There's rice and peas. Curry drumstick. Mm. She let me taste the jerk chicken, it was good, but because my tongue is so sensitive to pepper, I love pepper, but it's really bad now, very sensitive. So I couldn't, um, so I couldn't take that, so I didn't take it, but it tastes good. This is barbecue from cake. Mm. Okay. I mean, it's all good. But sometimes we make our things more mine out. Something is on cake. 
I don't know if I'll do the barbecue again, but I'll definitely do the curry. If I happen to be here nearby. Alright guys. See you in a bit. Okay guys. So almost ate the whole thing. I'm really full. And that's it. <laughs> that's all. I'm gonna close out the vlog. And I'll see you in the next one. Alright, so like the video, subscribe, and all those good stuff. Bye!